He wanted that. Damn it. Let's see if we can get another. Should be a shallow. Well, it's sound is saying no feet over here. Let's go. Oh, that might be a bass, I think. The tackle frog is getting the nibs, but they're not eating it down. Straight over that weed. Damn it. I don't know if it's the same fish or not. He's in a different area. We move so quick that you just don't know. Not that I'm any kind of expert on Queensland Barrow. I got my first one this afternoon, so. But he was really moving once he got going, tried to stitch me up. I'd love to get one on top water. Yes! Yes! That was epic. Oh, he's only little, but he was keen on that. Oh, he's a baby. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're missing it. There might be more this size in here. But, oh man, I appreciate him anyway. What an awesome fish. This one will fit a little bit better in the net if I can get him in. That's the tackle frog. Mr. Maeda was kind enough to send me a couple over to try and I finally got out here to do it. Shout out Mr. Maeda, Mr. Maeda in Japan. Yes, he's only little, but I love him. Look at that. Beautiful. On that Tatula combo again, but he's just really come after that tackle frog. What a beautiful fish. In the corner of the jaw, he was hitting it and moving away, obviously. Like I say, he's not a monster. I thought he might have been a, a good sized bass, but oh man, I'm so happy to see him and look at where I am. How could you want to be anywhere else? Uh, I'm going to deal with this guy and uh, and get him back. So pretty. Oh, biting down already. He wants back in. Let's go see if I can't find your bigger brother.